Look, I believe that everyone is free to make their own choices. Whichever side that you land on, go for it. But as soon as you bring kids into the mix of it and you start playing with their minds, giving them a book that's got two men sucking on each other, that's what you call confusing a mind. Social media posts showing male teens giving lap dances to school staff. What's up everyone, before we get started today, Flora CBD has sponsored this video. I gotta tell you, I quit dipping about four months ago and this stuff has been a big part of me quitting dip after 10, 12 years of dipping a can to a can and a half a day. Texture is the same, it tastes great. And it takes a little bit of the edge off without the negative side effects of the high. So there's gonna be a discount code below the video, go try some. What's up everybody, welcome back to HDC. I'm currently in the middle of moving, but I wanted to talk about something today because it's just kind of getting crazy out there. So it's no surprise that people are confused out there. And when I mean confused, I don't mean, hey, I really can't figure out this math problem right now. Or I can't figure out why my girlfriend wants to sit on her ass and eat chocolate all day. Not that kind of confused. That stuff's pretty normal. No, I'm talking about, for example, a gay men's choir saying that they're coming for our kids. Y'all remember that? The San Francisco gay men's choir that had confirmed pedophiles in it singing the song. Y'all must be confused. But it doesn't stop there, obviously, with the woke part of the nation and their obsession, yes, obsession, with their gender issues. I think it's fair to say that everybody who believes in men and women and believes that a man and a woman is more than a thought, it's more than, you know what? I think I'm gonna be a woman today. Yeah, I'm a woman. Yep, yep, that's fair. It's more than that. But some people feel like they can just be God and change it. The baby has been able to latch, but I've not been able to produce any milk. It's okay because we're gonna supplement the feeding with formula so that- And here's the thing, and this is the most concerning part about all of this is these woke people who are trying to make this gender transition in America, they're not worried about us. They're not targeting us. They know that we think it's a joke. Who they are targeting is the kids of our nation. Let me give you a little example. There was a school that had children give lap dances. Yes, lap dances like in a strip club to their teachers. Social media posts showing male teens giving lap dances to school staff. The several students dressed like Hooters restaurant servers, carrying mugs of what looked like beer. Some of the teen boys dressed in women's lingerie and danced on or near school leaders. The school superintendent says he's received several calls from outraged parents. Whoo, man. If I had a kid at that school and I found out that they were making him give lap dances to one of the teachers? Oh boy. But y'all that are woke think all oh, this is normal. This is fun. This is the way y'all want America. It's not fun. It's wrong. It's weird. And now they're trying to push it into schools. Grade schools. Preschools. High schools. They want to teach about gender identity and gender Fluidity, whatever that means. They wanna give your kid a book that has basically porn in it. And not just porn, gay porn. Here's an example. There's a superintendent in a school called Kingstown High School that says that this book, Gender Queer, supports sexual health. Well, I don't think kids need to know anything about sexual health yet. They're kids. The only thing they need to know is that's used to empty your bladder out. Only thing they need to know about it. I 
I have an idea. It's going to sound really crazy to some of you. If you want anything extreme taught in schools, like, I don't know, teaching that eating trash is a good idea. Critical race theory. This gender stuff. Anything you could possibly think of. You want schools to teach your kids to eat paint chips? Fine. But guess what? You can do it at home. Take 10 minutes away from your gender support group and teach your kids what you want to teach them. But as far as schools go, they don't need any of that. They need stuff that's going to prepare them for life. Not to confuse them on, well, I don't know, mommy. Should I talk to the boy over there or the girl? I don't know what I feel yet. Yeah, because your nuts haven't dropped, buddy. But once they do, you'll figure it out. But until then, go play with your toys. Stop worrying about it. And tell the parents who were telling you to worry about it to f*** off. The teachers, too.